Now, from Las Vegas, this is 13 Action News Live at Midday. Right now on the Valley's only 11 o'clock newscast, Metro is investigating a homicide on the west side of the Valley. Plus, the potential for terror attacks in the U.S. now on the rise after two Americans are stabbed overseas. Hello, everyone, and thanks for joining us for 13 Action News Live at Midday. I'm Dana Roselli. Well, a tragic end to the hours-long search for a missing child. Police have found the body of three-year-old Daniel Theriot in a remote area right near Lake Mead. His mom and her boyfriend have been arrested in connection to his murder. 13 Action News reporter Nina Porchinkula is live from Metro headquarters with more on this story. Nina. Uh, Dana, this story has been absolutely gut-wrenching. Police found the body of the missing three-year-old early this morning, and they believe he's been dead since Saturday night. That's 12 hours before the first 911 call was made when he was reported missing. This is absolutely, um, I mean, it's hard to deal with. This three-year-old boy, Daniel Theriot, has been found dead. The suspects, his own mother, and her boyfriend. It all started with a search for a missing person Sunday morning when police got a call from a young mother saying she went to Sunset Park with her three-year-old child. When she arrived at the park, she said she made a phone call. And while she was on the phone, she told police the child had walked away. We started doubting if the three-year-old was actually ever at the park. They suspected foul play and launched two separate investigations, a missing person and a criminal. Investigators worked the case overnight. Eventually, Daniel's mother led them to his body in a remote area near Lake Mead. There's nothing accidental about this investigation as far as the death of this child. Now, Daniel has a two-year-old sibling who has now been taken by CPS, and we're told that child has been abused as well. Now, police haven't identified the suspects yet, only saying that the mom is a 20-year-old woman and the boyfriend is in his 40s, and they will be booked later this afternoon. Police say the parents do have a criminal history and they are going to face child abuse and murder charges. Dana? Mm, such a devastating turn of events there. Thanks, Nina, for the update. Here's the deal. When this was first reported, many of you did ask why you didn't get an Amber Alert about this case on your phones, and that's because there are very specific requirements to launch one in Nevada. The case has to be confirmed an abduction. The child has to be in danger. Authorities also have to have the type of car the suspect is driving and a license plate number to issue the Amber Alert. Well, Metro Police are investigating a homicide on the west